What's up? I'm Randall. I'm here to talk to you about the number one question that you've been asking since your very birth, which was how do I know if the one I want to marry is the one? And I had a friend call me yesterday and was like, Randall, how did you know that Bianca was the one that you wanted to marry? And I said, bro, that's a great question. I didn't. I didn't know. I had no idea. Now, Bianca will tell you something different. She will say, yeah, the moment I met Randall or a couple days after, I don't know if Bianca, you're watching this, please don't kill me. I'm just kidding. You would never. She went to her mom and she said, mom, I think, I think this is the guy I'm going to marry. And I said, wow, how did you get to that conclusion? Because I'm a little slow on the pickup. You know what I mean? For me, it was a little bit of a slower process and that's okay. I wasn't expecting like a divine, like this is the one you will marry this woman. All I knew was that I liked her. We got along really well and we led each other to holiness and our relationship was healthy. That's all I knew. Pretty much since then, I, I've been taking it just one day, one day at a time. Every single day, I chose her. Every single day, I chose to love her and to be loved by her. And I fell more in love with this person. And the more I fell in love with them, the more the idea of getting engaged seemed like a really great idea. And one day I said, you know, I think I could continue to love this person for much, much longer. And the idea of getting engaged seemed like a much more solid reality. The reason I knew was because I just took it one day at a time. Eventually we got engaged because as our relationship developed, engagement became a lot more clear. And the opposite can be true as well. If I'm developing this relationship and I'm taking it one day at a time, if I'm honest with myself, I would be able to determine if there are qualities about our relationship or qualities about this person that I don't know if I would want to be married to or commit to long term for the rest of my life. And I'm not saying they have to be perfect, but I think if we're honest with ourselves, those things can be huge indicators that will come up over time. And engagement is just another step forward. It's still great, it's just another step forward. And then from there, you continue to choose that person and love that person. The discernment of whether or not I wanna be married to this person doesn't have to be super complicated. Now, those complications can be really valid, like where are we gonna live? What's our income gonna look like? What are my parents gonna think? Absolutely valid. And I had a lot of those same questions, but a lot of those same questions aren't necessarily indications of whether or not you should get engaged. Those are questions of where you should live. Those are questions of what they're gonna think. But none of those answer the question of, do you love this person? None of those answer the question of, do you see a life with this person and whether or not this person is bringing you closer to holiness? How do I know if this person's the one? You'll know if you take it one day at a time and if you're honest with yourself. Hey, here's some criteria before I end. A, do I love this person? And B, do they love me? C, is our relationship holy? And D, is our relationship healthy? At least, are they striving to be? If those are questions that I can say yes to, then I think engagement is a viable, a viable option moving forward. So bottom line, really the point of what I'm trying to say is, uh, we don't have to make it more complicated than it has to be. And if things are challenging, that's okay. So take that, pray with it, look into it, and be honest with yourself about where your relationship is at and the potential of where it could go. And just take it one step at a time, man. That's all we have to do is just take it one step at a time. So I hope that helps. Let me know what y'all think. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks for watching. Peace.